When you think of high fashion, you probably don't think of 3D printing. But that's exactly the technology one young Canberra designer has turned to as she bids to shake up fashion convention. The recent TAFE graduate has made an entire dress using 3D printers and now she's taking her digital dreams to Canada. Using a printer instead of a needle and rubber instead of thread, this 23-year-old has an eye for fashions of the future. Everything is printed in rubber. Um, there's not a piece on that dress that's not printed through rubber. With the support of a local design company, this dress has taken months of meticulous planning and 800 hours of printing. The cost? About $90,000. Good job. For one butterfly to be printed, only one, um, it takes five and a half hours. And the dress consists of 130 to 150 butterflies. It's a massive job. So we've got six dedicated printers to it running uh, night and day. And nothing goes to waste. And usually this gets discarded. So what I've done is I've recycled them and I've actually made them into a little bit of a handbag. Final adjustments are underway before the dress hits the catwalk at the Vancouver Fashion Week. Comfy still? It is, yes. <laughs> Where it's hoped she can break down any 3D printing misconceptions. It's not just your car parts, it's um, not just your heart, your lungs, it's fashion, it's clothing. You can make these awesome fabrics through 3D printing without harming anyone or any living thing or, you know, the environment for one. The next step is to create a sustainably printed runway collection. 3D printing just gives you a lot more opportunity. If you have a small business like mine, a small label, you can mass manufacture within your home. You can make those jewellery pieces without going, um, you know, overseas. Ensuring a new look. Looking straight ahead, I think. For a new digital age. Alkira Ryan Frank, ABC News, Canberra.